So it's me, your little boy, Eki Samson. I have something unique for us today, choosing. So, what I have for us is this. Listen, there are what? There are imagine. How come? Everything about you is truly different. There are imagine. How come? Everything concerning you is what is useful. There are imagine. How come? Whatsoever you touch. And wherever you go, you find favor without them. Let me tell you, there are a lot of people who have automatically concluded. When I mean conclude, they concluded that without them, you won't be able to amount for something. Without them, you won't be able to amount for something great. That is why today, majority of them now are regretted why they leave you. That is why today now, many of them are thinking ah how come is it that what we planted before what we have sowed before is now something that we have we are not seeing because many of them have already sowed a world of failure because the bible says when men sleep the enemy so ties many of them have sowed world of failure into your life many of them have automatically said behind the scene that you won't be able to amount for something you won't be able to make it but believe me, it shocked them because they can see the sign of the touch of God in your life. It's something so complicated to them. It's something so what unbelievable, incredible, <laughs> unexpected. Your life is something what unexpected to them. You know what I'm saying? It's something unexpected because many of them believe me they never in their entire life believe that they will see what they are saying right now they never in their entire life believe in you they never imagine that something great will come from you they have plot all evil they have did the worst because they believe that where others stop that is the same place where you will stop what the way other people ended that is the same way you will end but believe me Everything around you, everything about you is something that is not scaring them. Because what they thought would do it will be your end. The way they thought you will end, the way they imagine you will end, the way they thought everything about you will end is something that they are not seeing. It's something that they are not seeing. So it's really, really frustrating them because... God, in his own ways of doing, touch things around. God, in his own ways of doing, change things around. So your life is teaching majority of people up there something to keep. Your life has become something that is now letting them know that it's not by strength shall no man prevail. And it's not by multitudes. It's not by cloud. It's not by who is with you or who is against you. It is he that do that dwelleth in you. Because the Bible says the rich the what the 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 the, the, the what the riches of the Gentiles belongs to the what to the children of what to the what to the children of God. So believe me, everything about you is something that they never imagined. It's something that they never expect from you. So that is why many of them now are like, how come do you made it? Even without them, how come do you do it? Despite of all despair, despite of all the setup, despite of all the deed, despite of all that they have automatically put together to make sure they stop you the way they stop others. But nothing work because you are built by God, not by men. Remember blessed?